so you wouldn't ever make black metal now, but did, do you think black metal has influenced your uh, your non black metal mu music that you've made? You think only I think only aesthetically, like the extremity right. of, of black metal, like just the attitude. Because there is a certain irony that you you know some of your favorite bands are bands like Venom. Oh yeah. But the music you make is about as far from Venom as it could be. Really. Even the oh, Venom. Oh, like Morris is a Venom tribute band. I mean, how could you? How could you miss it? <laughs> is that the Venom of Dungeon Sim? It's the Venom Sim. Yeah. Um, no, I am very much aware of that, and um, but you know, um, I think it's okay to do one thing and also enjoy another thing. Of course, yeah. Um, that's a, that that's basically the principle of it, as mm -hmm. far as I'm concerned. Um, atmospherically, I think I'm close to black metal. It's, uh, black metal has always been, in, in my world, has always been not necessarily about the, whether it's heavy or fast or aggressive, it's the atmosphere. Right. The atmosphere that you can convey through your music. And I think at that level, very much, we're quite similar. Mm -hmm. um, that's my way of looking at it. And, um, but I, I don't aspire to be like black metal. I just happen to have a past that's associated with it. Yeah. And I enjoy certain aspects of black metal. I think black metal, like I told you, I, I think it became um, very generic in the mid 90s, unfortunately. Um, but I don't think black metal had a choice. There were so many people suddenly making it all of a sudden you had a thousand bands to steal ideas from because let's face it we steal ideas that's what we do um that's how you invent your sound um you know you, you take it from someone else and you hopefully you add your own character to it um but back in the old days we had about 10 bands we could copy from and that was like fucking battery hellhammer venom the first slayer album and um you know, the German bands, Sodom yeah. Destruction, um, Creator, Endless Pain. And that was about it, you know? Uh, so, you didn't have a lot of choice. You had to be creative. But all of a sudden, you know, three or four years later, there's 500 fucking bands doing it. So there's a lot more to steal from, and this, it just becomes, this is my personal opinion, it just becomes more and more watered out. Mm -hmm. So, and that was, that was when I kind of, I punched out of it. I was like, okay, fuck this. Uh, this is getting quite boring to me. Um, I'm gonna go back to fucking listening to Kiss and Iron Maiden and Saxon and fucking ACDC, which is what, what I grew up with. Yeah. Um, and I've basically stayed there ever since.